In quantum electrodynamics, Babler scattering is the electron-positron scattering process. There are two leading or definement diagrams contributing to this interaction, an annihilation process and a scattering process. Babhla scattering is named after the Indian physicist Homi J. Babhla. The Babhla scattering rate is used as a luminosity monitor in electron-positron colliders. Differential cross-section, to leading order, the spin average differential cross-section for this process is. Where S, T, and U are the Mandelstam variables, is the fine structure constant, and is the scattering angle. This cross-section is calculated neglecting the electron mass relative to the collision energy and including only the contribution from photon exchange. This is a valid approximation at collision energies small compared to the mass scale of the Z boson, about 91 GeV. At higher energies the contribution from Z boson exchange also becomes important. Equals Mandelstam variables equals, in this article, the Mandelstam variables are defined by where the approximations are for the high energy limit. Deriving unpolarized cross section. Equals matrix elements equals, both the scattering and annihilation diagrams contribute to the transition matrix element. By letting K and K represent the full momentum of the positron, while letting P and P represent the full momentum of the electron, and by using Feynman rules one can show the following diagrams give these matrix elements. Notice that there is a relative sign difference between the two diagrams. Equals square of matrix element equals, to calculate the unpolarized cross section, one must average over the spins of the incoming particles and sum over the spins of the outgoing particles. That is, first, calculate. Equals scattering term equals, magnitude squared of m. Sum over spins, next. We'd like to sum over spins of all four particles. Let S and S be the spin of the electron and under be the spin of the positron. Now that is the exact form, in the case of electrons one is usually interested in energy scales that far exceed the electron mass. Neglecting the electron mass yields the simplified form. Equals inhalation term equals, the process for finding the inhalation term is similar to the above. Since the two diagrams are related by crossing symmetry, and the initial and final state particles are the same, it is sufficient to permute the momenta, yielding. This is proportional to where is the scattering angle in the center of mass frame. Equals solution equals, evaluating the interference term along the same lines and adding the three terms yields the final result. Simplifying steps. Equals completeness relations equals, the completeness relations for the four spinners U and V are where equals trace identities equals main article trace identities to simplify the trace of the Dirac gamma matrices one must use trace identities three used in this article are the trace of any product of an odd number of s is zero using these two one finds that for example uses Babhla scattering has been used as a luminosity monitor in a number of E plus A collider physics experiments. The accurate measurement of luminosity is necessary for accurate measurements of cross sections. Small angle Babhla scattering was used to measure the luminosity of the 1993 run of the Stanford Large Detector, with a relative uncertainty of less than 0.5%. Electron positron colliders operating in the region of the low lying hadronic resonances such as the Beijing electron synchrotron and the Bell and Barbarby factory experiments, use large angle Babhla scattering as a luminosity monitor. To achieve the desired precision at the 0.1% level, the experimental measurements must be compared to a theoretical calculation including next to leading order radiative corrections. 1. The high precision measurement of the total hadronic cross section at these low energies is a crucial input into the theoretical calculation of the anomalous magnetic dipole moment of the muon, which is used to constrain supersymmetry and other models of physics beyond the standard model. References A study of small angle radiative Babhla scattering and measurement of the luminosity at SLD, Halton, Francis. Martin, Allon. Quarks and leptons. An Introductory Course in Modern Particle Physics. John Wiley & Sons.
ISBN 0-471-88741-2. Peskin, Michael E. Schroeder, Daniel V. An Introduction to Quantum Field Theory. Perseus Publishing. ISBN 0-201-50397-2. Babhu Scattering on Arxiv.org.